the latest uh, scandal slash gossipy thing in the Hollywood world is uh, Martin Scorsese uh, dared, so, as they call it, to speak his opinion about a, a film series, the Marvel film world. This caused a bit of a backlash against him because these days you're not allowed to think what you want about popular stuff. So uh, what was your take on the, uh, the, the so-called backlash against Scorsese speaking his mind? Well, I think that the backlash was a, uh, a little uh, overwrought. He uh, revised his comments the other day. Uh, basically, what he's saying is that these Marvel movies, not all of them, but most of them, that's me amending what he said, they don't take risks. Right? Yeah. Because it's sort of preordained that um, they have to keep the ball rolling. So I think I think if he had couched his remarks in saying um, film series, I mean, you could say you could argue the same thing about any kind of film series, like uh, James Bond, for example. Like we know that James Bond will never die in a movie, the ultimate stake. I think what he's I think what he's saying in, in inelegant terms is there's a difference between drama and melodrama. Yeah. But that's probably like a little too sophisticated and too simple for an interview. Like if I said that to you and left it at that, you go, well, oh, so. No, but the point is, is that uh, most of the motion picture business from the studios is frankly, in fact, not drama, it's melodrama. In that the definition of drama is a character rises and falls the protagonist rises and falls rises on his on uh, his or her own merits and falls on his or her own flaws that's a drama the classical definition of a drama and in a comedy the protagonists uh, rise and they have a happy ending 